Campeche, on Mexico's Yucatan Peninsula, an agricultural region whose name means place of snakes and ticks in the native Mayan language. But since 2013, there's been a new insect in town, the sugarcane aphid, which has wreaked havoc on the state's agricultural industry. The solution to the problem? More insects. This is the green lacewing, a member of the Chrysopidae insect family. Their larvae are known as aphid lions for one simple reason. They ferociously prey on aphids and other insect pests and eggs known to damage crops. Charged by the state government with the production of these pest-fighting bugs, Professor Miguel Burgos today runs a laboratory that produces enough lacewings to feast on the pests covering 20,000 hectares of crops a year. In a single week, these aphids can invade a hectare of crops. And these predatory insects also have predators, so they completely alter the food chain. The treatment will never completely wipe out the pests, but they will reduce their numbers to an extent where they don't damage the crops as nature regulates itself on its own. The insect eggs are sold across the state for $3 per hectare, a significant saving over the cost of traditional chemical pesticides. Burgos says over a year, the savings can total 80 per cent for a local farmer. And in addition to being cheaper, the process is entirely eco-friendly. The agricultural products that come from fields treated with these insects are completely safe because they have not come into contact with chemical pesticides. Our goal as a lab is through the production of these insects to eliminate the use of chemicals in combating pests. Aneri Serrano is a Campeche-based biologist and says this sort of eco-friendly alternative is essential for more sustainable agriculture. The insects take longer to have an effect than chemical pesticides, so the farmers, who are generally from poor backgrounds, can be harder to convince to use these biological methods. But once they're available at lower costs, produced on a larger scale and made easily accessible, they'll be a very viable form of pest control. As Campeche State tackles its problem with pests, it's doing so in a sustainable way by letting Mother Nature do the work. Alastair Bavostok, CGTN, Campeche, Mexico.